beautiful. Good morning, beautiful people. Welcome to Sun Flow Sunrise Yoga, where we rise with the sun. I am your guide, your what I say, teacher, the person helping you flow because you are your ultimate teacher. And if you want to switch it up, listen to your body. That is the most important thing. All right. It is a gorgeous rainy day. I love the rain. So I'm very happy, but I'm not sure how much sun we're actually going to get. doesn't matter. It's still coming around. So let's begin sitting on our knees. If you choose, you can definitely sit on your toes. Use your hands to kind of curl under those pinky toes. And with our hands on our legs, we're just gonna do a like gentle cat cow. So opening up the chest, inhale. And then that exhale, round. And if you're sitting on your feet, same thing. Just a really gentle. Closing and opening of the heart space. Go as fast or as slow as you want. But just see if you can make it juicy and go a little bit deeper each time. Inhale, stuck in all that good medicine. And exhale, pump it through the body. Beautiful. Inhale, place the left hand on the earth beside you, right arm stretches over. Place side stretch. Uh, exhale, come to center. And then as you inhale, place that right hand, stretch the left arm. Just that a few times. I actually took a week off because I've been a little sick. I'm still a little stuffy, but I feel so much better than I did. All right, now come on to your bottom and to Sukhasa. We're gonna do a nice gentle neck stretch. So let your left ear fall toward your left shoulder. Inhaling and exhaling here, not pushing or pulling anything. Just let gravity do its job. Keeping the spine straight and focusing on full inhales and full exhales. If you want to go a little bit deeper, Inhale that left arm up all toward the sky. And then as you exhale, bend the elbow and allow that left hand to just lie on top of the ear. Really not pulling here, but if you feel like there's a different part of your neck that you want to stretch, you can roll your chin forward and roll it back. If you want a little bit deeper of a stretch here, you can walk your right hand away from your body. We're gonna walk that right arm back. Bring that left arm back to our knee, left, left hand back to our knee, and then come back up to center. Maybe notice a difference. Let's do the other side. Right ear fall forward. 
Full score the right shoulder. Spine straight. Allowing each exhale to sink you deeper into the stretch. Start in the morning easy. Remembering gentle to be gentle on our bodies. And again, if you want to go deeper, inhale, right arm up. Exhale, place the right arm on top of the left. Walk a little bit and no way from the body. And breathe. And again, if you want to find a different spot to stretch, you can roll up the chin forward or backward. Do some Sufi circles. So keeping our bottom fully planted on the earth as if our legs are made of cement. We're going to spin as if our crown chakra is being pulled by a thread and somebody is spinning in a circle above. This is a way of connecting with that divine energy. Go as quickly or as slowly as you want. I like to go with my breath, inhaling forward, exhaling back. You can use your hands on your knees to help you get deeper into the stretch. Such directions. You can even open your neck and go forward, bring your chin and chest on the way back. Awesome. Now let's do a nice simple seated twist here as well. So inhale, arms up. Exhale, whiskey arms stretching up toward the sky. Rotate the body to the right, just as far as it wants to go. And then wherever it stops, place your hands down. Inhale, straighten. Exhale, twist. Looking over that right shoulder. your heels back up toward your body. 
and on your exhale, go into tabletop pose. Hands under their shoulders, knees under their hips. Let's do a few more cat cow pose and see. Inhale, open, exhale, round. hands into the earth, pushing evenly into all points of the hand. As you tuck your toes up, the knees up, and push back into a downward facing dog. You can walk the dog down here. Oh, it feels good. Or simply find stone. Step or jump to the front of your Draw this nice forward fold, grab onto opposite elbows. And there can be a nice slight bend in the knee or a really dramatic one where you're letting the belly rest on top of your thighs. So that always feels really good. Together, exhale, hands to the center. Hand Hug those back toes under as you inhale, squeezing your energy center. Inhale. Inhale, 
right arm up. Exhale, place that right hand inside your right foot or right elbow on the right knee. Left arm up. And then exhale, right hand up. Straighten that right leg. Exhale, keeping that right leg straight. Right hand inside, right foot, left hand up. Facing dog, downward facing dog, jump, step or walk to the front of your mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, just stand. Exhale, hands to heart center. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. And exhale, step back with the lift, step step with the right. Inhale, that little left foot up towards the sky. Bend the knee. Open the hip. Look over your right shoulder and your toes. Straight in the leg. Exhale, bring that knee into the chest, stepping that left foot between the hands of the top of the Beautiful. And drop that right knee, untuck those toes. Hold them up. Make sure that foot is underneath the knee. You can still see your big toes. Those toes on their behind the back. Squeeze into the side as you lift up. And then exhale, warrior. Inhale. Exhale, place the left hand inside the left foot or upright left arm on the right knee. Exhale, straighten the left leg, left hand up. Exhale. Inhale, deep deep. And then on the same exhale, float through the plank. And turn on the breath. Upward facing dog. Down and facing the hook. Step or jump to the front of your neck. And now for a pose. And heel up. Center here, computer is about to no longer be alive. So let's, from standing, point the toes to face that was at your mouth, come into a yogi squat, elbows inside of the knees, hands in the heart. Place the left hand on the earth as you open up the right up top of the sky. Exhale, do the same thing, right hand on the earth, left arm up to the sky. Now please take some time to lay in Shavasana, even if it's only for a minute. So, 
I think it's the best way to get out of here. This is just gently fall back on your bottom as gently graceful as you can. Have a good laugh. Remember to laugh for yourself. Beginner's mindset. Or maybe just like want to sit in yoga for a squat for a little bit. I know this hip opener is what I needed. Oof. And thank you for watching. I will figure out a better setup for my videos. The sun is up. Oh, that's